What's up guys, Connor64 here, <clears throat> and of course if y'all haven't seen the YouTube short I just posted today, y'all already know what this video would be about, but of course y'all already would probably know what it's about by the thumbnail and the description and all that. So let's just get it on, I got it right here. <clears throat> here is the Death Egg playset, right here. So, let's get into this. Okay guys, sorry I had to uh, change my, to my, from my desk to my small little table. But, right here is the Death Egg playset. Okay guys, um, so, I, of course, I haven't done a review in a while. So, of course, right here we have Sonic with the 30th anniversary. And down here we have some of the mechanics and how it can be destroyed. Up here is the th also with the 30th anniversary. <coughs> Sorry about that. And of course up here, it's the basically the age limit of 7 and older. If we go to the side, we have some more Sonic the Hedgehog um, title card and all that. And 30th anniversary. We have the... Death Egg Robot with the Sonic and the ball where you can launch it and it's basically just showing you all the um all the things it can do and of course down here is Jack Pacific and of course on the on the bottom it's basically just stars and again the Sonic 30th anniversary on this side actually Shit, that doesn't, that doesn't look half bad, not gonna lie. Sorry for moving it a bit, but then when we get, of course on the back is with all the stuff. So, you'd start with, uh, hmm, okay, I guess it goes by, okay, we have the giant, for some reason it's called Eggman, well, it's called the, on the box it says Eggman Robot Battle set but y'all know this is the death egg robot from sonic uh i want to say sonic 2 but it also could be from generations the how the design kind of looks okay like right here we have the switch where where the um we can switch from the attacks where you can where he can actually shoot out the arms and if also if y'all want to read the text y'all can pause the video and all that, and the jet booster, and of course I'll see Eggman. Well, the Death Egg robot being destroyed by Sonic, roll into a ball. And also we have these little two-inch figures. With also we can also get the uh, Green Hill Zone playset. So guys, <clears throat> so. Let's unbox this big boy and let's see what's all his secrets. Okay guys, the first thing we're going to go over before we get to the main thing is the um the catapult. Basically, if you can't tell, it's kind of based off the death egg design. A bit like Eggman's base. Of course, you know this thing, wait, this, if you can't tell, this thing is basic it's basically just a normal catapult when all you gotta do is just flick it but let's put that down let's go over this little bitty classic sonic so basically if you can't tell yes he's rolled up into a ball and not a whole lot to it, but he is very rubbery, and I'm afraid about the nose part, because that thing is too rubbery, like, look at this. But, like, the whole thing is, like, the whole thing reminds me of one of those squishy little things you get in, like, those little things at, like, stores where you put a quarter in, and you get a little figure, or, like, whatever, and it comes, like, in a little circle box, kind of, and they... That thing's like cleared, you know. This is what it this is kind of what it reminds me of a little bit, but yeah. 
not a whole lot to it. There's no articulation, but, you know, you can put him like this. And he can, you know, spin, kind of. So, yeah. Not a whole lot to it. So, yeah, let's get on to the main attraction. The Death Egg Robot. I'm sorry if you can't see the whole thing. The whole thing. And also, ah, my back. My, I don't know why, but my back's in pain a bit. But, uh, yeah. We pick him up by the crotch. <laughs> like, not a whole lot to it, and you can only tell. So, let's go over the, uh, the articulation. The first one is, he has, of course, his arm can go all around. And it can go up to... And yes, the gimmick is the arm can come off. So let's just take it apart piece by piece, and so and basically show you what all of it can do. So if you put that all the way down here, this little shield piece right here can actually go like all the way like to here, and like. Kind of, I guess you can say it kind of goes all the way up, and not like that's all the way up to here. This is what the inside looks like, and this is the <clears throat> spike of the robot. I'm sorry, guys, I haven't done a um a unboxing in a long like in a long time. So yeah, and like you know, the thing shoots out, and of course, I already know I'm gonna be using this for like a stop motion. So this is. It can, uh, the only thing what does suck is it doesn't have wrist articulation. Like, not gonna lie, that would have been cool. Like, you know, like, and of course, you know, the, one, the, uh, arm attack cannon, basically from, uh, Sonic, from, from Sonic the Hedgehog 2, and basically all the Sonic, all the Sonic ends with the Death Egg robot, you know, because, you know, he always does shoot. And, uh, if I can put that in, basically the arm is basically the same way. And if you're probably wondering why the crack is right here, because when I tried to turn it to the clear one, for some reason, it does not, like, watch this. It doesn't want to click into place, so I just keep it on there. And the head moves all the way to right there and like and like that. Like it would be cool if it can turn a little bit more, but it, it's fine how it is. Not gonna lie, I do love this figure. And yeah. So let's get on with the back. Uh, hope it doesn't topple over. Cause that would be scary. <laughs> so the back is where the uh, backpack is where it has the uh, boosters. Where you know how the Death Egg Robot can fly. If I can just... Ah! Fuck! Mm, that hurt. For some reason, it's stuck in there. Get that give it some pressure. And, yeah, basically the that part's supposed to move out. But it seems like this one is stuck in there. I'll try to fix it. Wait. Oh. Okay. There we go. And because, like, in the game, it can fly up. And... Well, yeah. And of course, if you can't tell, the back does... It, okay, it does come off. But I think how I put it in there, I think I how the way I shoved it in to the back, I think it's going to be harder to take out. But that's fine by me. And so, let's see what the main mechanic of... And also, <clears throat> the legs, if I can... Okay, the legs don't really move. 
like a whole lot. Let me just put them on one leg. See like that. Like, okay, this part does can move up, but when it's in the robot, I've already tried messing with it and okay so it pretty much only has like this joint moves up and down and this back joint if you can hear the snapping like on this ball right here but this is that's all it does like there's not a whole lot to it and all that so yeah it's put the leg back in and then if uh, come on you can also see the peg hole ah oh, crap just shove it in see like if even if you okay you can do that wait let me just you can have it where it looks like he's kicking, but, and I do know a lot of you, a couple of YouTubers who've made videos like this, they put, um, they put something on it where the arms can actually st stick upwards like this, but I know they use, um, headphone, like the little, like the pieces, like the little pieces would go on headphones. Like, I got one right here. By trying to put it on, it, uh, it broke. So, yeah. And, yeah, these are just extra headphones from, like, extra headphone pieces. Ear, like, the ear pieces to headphones. And, you know, yeah. I'm, I'm thinking I'm gonna have to get, um bigger pieces or like a bigger headphone thing where it can actually slip in so let's try this mechanic out that's not quite like that uh like i would show you okay how about it oh, crap sorry for uh my bad guys okay let's do it like Sorry for moving the camera a lot. I'm just gonna try to show y'all. And of course, buy it. Okay, I'm just gonna have it like this and see how, and see how it shoots. Let me just move that. Y'all can see how far it shoots, and like it kind of hits. It doesn't really. It like the mechanic is supposed to work, but it doesn't. See, but how it was supposed to do is this. I'm about to show y'all. Oh god, I've always felt like my. Uh, And, and that is the death egg well on the box it's called the Eggman robot battle playset but we all know what it is the death egg robot playset that is what it actually is so guys um I do y'all I do hope y'all enjoyed this video but I haven't made a what I haven't made a unboxing video really in a long time like for figures you know for like figures I haven't made, I haven't done that in like a while the last time I think I did it was with the uh Sonic with the with the anniversary package from Sonic Generations from the Jack Pacific no wait, not Jack Pacific uh Jazzwares Sonic and Spinner but or it was uh, if it wasn't then it was probably the uh Shadow and Silver Pack but yeah guys um I will see y'all in the 
in a later video. So yeah. Also, I do hope y'all enjoyed this video. And oh, let me fix my hair real quick. And also, oh my god, my eye. And uh, also, hit, do hit the bell icon and all that to give notifications every time I upload a video. And I realize my subscriber count has been going crazy. And I'm like, I'm not expecting it. Like, I, to me, my I love my videos and I like them, but I don't, I gotta say, I don't think they're that good for people to enjoy them that much. But that's just my opinion. But I love my videos anyways. Because, yeah, they're cringy. And I know I'm cringy because a lot of my friends told me I'm a bit cringy. And, yeah. But I am glad y'all love my videos. And, of course, when I get to... Because right now I'm at 400 and something. Uh, well, more like 1K... I'm still at 1k, but like the 4, I'm going to wait until that turns in, that 4 turns into like a 5. So what I'm going to do is, um, I'm thinking if I get to, I get to 5, no, 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 not 5, my bad. I'm not going to lie, guys, I'm fucking bad with math. So uh, I'm thinking if I get to 2k, or if I get to 1k, 1 the little dash thing, 500 K, basically, if I get to that, I'm thinking about putting a thing out where y'all get to choose what video y'all want me to make. Of course, I'm going to put a list down of topics, so yeah, and if whatever, whatever topic gets the most views... Then after that, I'm going to do another thing about what, like, for the same thing, but, like, what y'all exactly want me to do. Like, this is just a small thing. Uh, Like, games. If y'all choose, if a lot of y'all choose games, before I even make my gaming channel, I do a game. I do a bit of a game on my on my normal channel because I have played games on my normal channel before before I even thought of making my gaming channel and but like if y'all want me to do more unboxing videos and then I do that or whatever y'all want me to continue doing or like you know stuff like that and also with what ifs I'm just gonna put a whole list down of different things what what like what y'all would want me to do so guys i hope y'all have a good day and a good weekend because even if this video i'm just saying if this video does not come out today it will come out maybe friday even even when i just said have a good weekend because the weekend is coming up and all that so yeah and of course you know after the, after when i'm done making this video i gotta do a lot of, i'm gonna do some editing and some stuff like that so i better get on to that and also i hope y'all enjoyed the video peace out